All right, what is going on my stock market bulls and bears? I am your host, Terry, and welcome to the channel. By the dip, guys, that is right, man. Today, we are back talking about the old favorite, Golden Nugget Online Gaming. What is going on? Have I bought? Have I sold? What, what have we been doing with this stuff? Well, we're going to get right into it here, guys. I haven't sold anything, as you can still see. Go back on all my Golden Nugget videos. I have 110 shares at an average cost of 13 14 you can go back videos from a month ago, two months, three months, six months. That's what it's been. I have not bought any or sold anything on my Robinhood account. This thing, I haven't sold any stocks, guys, at all during this entire crash. And I will show you that here towards the end of the video on my, um, my uh, messages here on Robinhood that I have not sold anything since back in March. And that was one share of GameStop that I did buy at $40 and I sold it for a hundred some dollars. And that was the last time back in March that I sold a stock. Um, and I have not sold over the last couple of months and all the holdings that you see here on the portfolio. I still got my 1100 shares of genius brands guys. I still hold my hundred shares of APXT. I still got 110 shares of STIC. Now there's a couple of new additions to the portfolio. As you can see, now I do have 200 shares of CCIV, which is Lucid. So that is where I've been adding money and I've been buying up Lucid down here in the $20 range. Now it's even $17.50. It's getting real attractive to be maybe you want to pick up more. Um, I did grab 100 shares of XL. Um, I did pay $8 for those and now they're down to $5.56. So I just when you think the market can't go any lower, every day it seems to surprise us and it gets crazy and just keeps going lower and lower and lower um but anyway i did go in for fun i bought 125 dogecoin just for the fun of it i think i put like 70 dollars or something into it so we'll see how that plays out but this video guys we're talking about gnog like i said my position hasn't changed at all and actually at this 10 dollar price i think this is my next stock that i want to get up to 200 shares and now that's on my Robinhood account as you guys know I do have 135 shares on my Fidelity and I do have 10 shares on Webull I still have all those holdings guys like I said I haven't sold anything I've been just adding money adding money added a few thousand dollars to buy up the rest of those Lucid Motors CCIV shares because I wanted to get my 200 share count on Lucid Motors now that I got that I think it's time to go back here to the original of golden nugget and at 1050 i'm about to get a couple hundred dollars to buy some shares up of this and try to get up to 200 shares of golden nugget while we're down here at these like pre like <laughs> pre-merger announcement prices like this is just amazing now people's like why you know people, there's a lot of people selling out you see a lot of youtubers where the views are going down and that doesn't bother me any because I've been sitting back, getting money, buying up these stocks at the price, because that's what the channel is, guys. Buy the dip, that's what I've been doing. Here's something that I do want to show you guys. The reason that I am still wanting to buy more Golden Nugget, and as you know, it ain't just Golden Nugget going down. The whole entire stock market is going down. There's a lot of uncertainty in the market about inflation and everything, and people was just... I don't know, they're paper hands right now. These big corporations and hedge funds and probably a lot of retail investors. I think there's probably a lot of people out there on margin and they're probably getting margin called and they had to liquidate everything to pay their margin. I, on the other hand, do not use margin. I will never use margin. I am just using the money that I have set aside to buy stocks when I can buy them. And that's exactly what I'm doing. And here's what I wanna show you guys. The New Jersey revenue for Golden Nugget here in March of 2021, $31.755 million. Guys, that is insane. Like, this business is getting more and more revenues. Like, this was March, so we're waiting to get April. April should be coming out here uh, very soon, but we got these March revenues, and I'll tell you what, we usually see like 26 million to 30 million. So to see this over 31 million to me is very impressive and a crazy time right now. And for this stock at 1050, I'm going all in right now. Any money that I can get um, off to the side, 
I'm gonna be purchasing up these shares. I don't care if I'm buying five shares, 10 shares, 20 shares. I'm buying them up because this stock at 1050 is like a bargain of a lifetime, guys. And the company is still making crazy amounts of money. And other great news on Golden Nugget coming up here is the Golden Nugget Online Gaming to hold first quarter of 2021 earnings conference call on May 17th. That's right. In four days, we're going to get the Q1 quarterly earnings for Golden Nugget. Now, that is pretty amazing. Here is the information. Uh, if you want to go through the webcast, through the company's investor relations, you can go to gnoginc.com. You can also dial either of these phone numbers here. This article came out on the Yahoo Finance. If you type in GNOG, this just came out yesterday about the earnings call. So there is a lot of great information to come out. And as we can see here, the year-to-date internet gross gaming revenue was $90 million for three months, guys, the gross revenues. Now, that is amazing. $90 million in three months. Golden Nugget is still bringing in tons of money in just New Jersey. Um, I'm about to come back on a separate video and take a look at what's going on in Michigan. But I wanted to come out here and talk about everything, about these revenues, as we see here for March, man, $31 million. For the three months, we got over $90 million in revenues. We got the quarterly earnings coming up, which will be the official earnings call. And as crazy as this is, they can have a phenomenal earnings call. And this stock is still probably going to stay the same, if not go down more. Which is just, I never would have thought would, in a million years this stock would be down below my average cost of $13, $14. But I have no interest in selling this, guys. You know... I'm a long-term investor. I am not going anywhere on my stocks. Um, they're all still in my portfolio. Um, I'm gonna show you the one-year chart and be as transparent as I can, guys. And yeah, I'm down 9.8% right now. So down like 900 bucks because of this crazy market. But look at the highs right here. If we get a recovery back, guys, right there, be up 50%, up almost $5,000. That was before the crash of where we would have been at. Now, keep in mind, when this was going down, I was adding money and buying the dips on this. So I wasn't buying when this was like up here in a sense. As this started going down, I was buying in at all these uh, prices and just buying and buying and buying. So that's why my money that I put in is a lot higher than what it normally is because I've added a few extra thousand dollars of this and buying up those CCIVs, and I'm holding them babies for three to five years, if not even longer, because I just see that being a great money maker. Um, as we know, CCIV is gonna have two locations at Tyson's Corner, about an um, hour and a half from where I live. So that there is truly amazing. And I do wanna show you this here, guys. I'm gonna be as transparent, man. Yeah, I'm getting beat up in the stock market, just like everyone else. We're down about a little under 10%, down 900 and some bucks. But we know it's going to turn around. And as you can see here on my messages, I, there's where I bought my Dogecoin. There's where I deposited um, 800 bucks. I bought 40 shares of Churchill Capital. Here I did buy 100 shares of Genius Brands. Here's where I bought um, 100 shares of XL Fleet. Here's where I bought 10 shares of Northern Star. And as you can see, I haven't sold anything, guys. I haven't sold anything. Uh, the last sale I did do was right here. GameStop, your order to sell one share on March 4th. And then there, I, I had an options contract. It did expire, and I was forced to sell 100 shares of Express Spa back on February 20th. So I haven't sold any stock since March the 4th on my Robinhood account. And I just wanted to come out here and show you that, guys, to be transparent with you all. Um, just things have been crazy in the market, so I took a little break and just reassessing the market and what I wanted to do. And you come to that decision. When the market's crashing, do you paper hand and sell out? Or do you have diamond hands and do what we talk about in this channel, which is buy the dip. That's right, guys. So that is exactly what I did. I said, you know what? I'm going all in on these companies. And now that I got the position out on CCIV, we're going to get ready to take off on GNOG. We're going to get this up to Robin Hood at 200 shares in my next goal. Uh, I think as long as this is under... That $13 price target of where I'm at in my average price, I will keep buying this up. So I will be back probably here in the next week or so with some more shares on GNOG. 
as I get some more money into the Robinhood account. And it does come to that question, guys. Do we buy shares or do we buy long call options? So I was looking here at the options and I want to go as far out as I can go because we don't know what's going to happen in this crazy market. And right now, the far as you can go is January 20th of 2023. And I mean, you can buy a $12.50 call for 355 bucks. And that's like, what, a year and a half out? Or is this market going to be recovered in a year and a half? So that is the question. Do we buy shares or do we get a couple hundred bucks and buy some options, some long, long call options? Because we don't know how long this crazy market is going to go. So guys, hope you all enjoyed this video and update on GNOG. I wanted to get back here and get transparent with you all. So guys, hit that thumbs up and links down below. Peace.